Hello everyone, this is Sumi Shai Sims here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you're all doing all right and safe. So today we're touring this apartment building. Um, as soon as we got this lot, I was like, I have to build an apartment on this specific lot. It's just so pretty. Um, it has a parking lot uh, on the side as well. So it's like really fit for an apartment as well. And uh, so yeah, I've used the smaller lot for it so we you can build this for in uh, on a smaller lot if you want to and i love the new um balcony railings that we just got from the recent event and um i think i forgot to add a window on this last apartment there but it's okay um so yeah the, this is the apartment in here so uh, here we have the uh the sign of the apartment it says luxury meadow in there and there is a little greenery and area here a little uh grass area where you can sit and chill and uh yeah it's uh really well maintained it has um nice little landscaping uh beside on the side of the building and in the front and this type of buildings are usually really really well maintained so through the double door here we have the lobby area and I've used those new floor um, from the recent event. I love them in here. And here we have the reception area and this is George. Uh, he is the receptionist so he's taking care of this apartment. Uh, he makes sure all the tenants pay their bills on time and the activities are all known by um, the tenants, you know and things like that you know if you have if somebody wants to come visit um they have to pass by him you know um and uh he makes sure that there are no intruders you know and things like that and there is even a vending machine in here in the lobby area and i put a light above it so you're like hey ho there is a you know vending machine in here so that's good and it has a couple of seats to sit on there and through this door here is the mail room so um the tenants mail would come in here and uh they would just come in here and um grab their mails their parcel and things like that from here and you will notice that uh beside all the doors there is a panel and why is that because um they have to swipe their cards uh in order to uh, access the facilities so there's no other intruder using their um you know facilities and here is another tenant doing her laundry so this is the laundromat of the building so all the laundry is happening in here and the tenants can do their own laundries in here because um the apartment the apartments don't have laundry uh washing machine and dryer in there because they're too small you know but hey, that's where um, they can come and, uh, you know, talk to, each other, uh, talk to each other or socialize or things like that. So through these doors in here, we have a spa area that, that all the tenants um, share, you know. So they can just come here and um, share the space and socialize again. And if we went through this little hallway here. Uh, there is a bathroom area that's tucked away in here so George can use this bathroom or anyone who is you know passing by can use um, this bathroom in here it's actually a powder room not a bathroom and then through the hallway we are going onto the stairway area but before that there is a door that leads onto another space and it has another panel there and by the way that's not a glitch the panel goes right beside the stairs and here they have a gym uh, for the building so the tenant can come here and have their workouts done and there is Tyrell one of the tenants as well who is doing his uh, session gym session and right beside the gym uh, area there is a fountain so um, they can you know quench their thirst after a hard workout so there is an apartment on the ground floor here and this apartment is owned by a senior who is a professor at sim city so here is the entryway there is just a bare entryway here 
with just a coat rack and then as soon as you enter there is a hallway that leads onto the dining and living and dining area in here and I like the color scheme that I've used in here it's all gray and beige and wood and white I just like how it turned out this is the little dining area here and uh, uh, right across the entryway there is a door that leads onto the bathroom area and I think the bathroom uh, is really nice and luxurious uh, it's a four piece bathroom with a double sink a tub um, and then a shower of course and the toilet is tucked away and uh, all the bathrooms are above each other and all the kitchens are above each other so uh, plumbing makes sense as well so you'll see that and i think these tiles work really well in here in the bathroom and uh, the beige one in the kitchen i think they work really really well so here we have the kitchen area and the kitchen is fully equipped and modern um, I've used the same items so that I don't uh, reach the object cap too soon, you know, so I had to use the same kitchen items, but I did put a little decoration here and there so that um, it tells you a little bit about the tenants that sleeves in here. So um, yeah, and through the dining area, there is a door that leads onto the bedroom area so here is the tenant of uh, this specific apartment this is Lisa Hamilton uh, she's a professor at Sim City as I said um, Sim City University and uh, she's widowed uh, her children's her children's are all away and married and all but she's gonna be you know retiring soon and uh, she's living alone in this apartment and she's really happy so that was our first apartment and all the apartments are cute and pretty like that in here and there are seven of them so i hope you will stay tuned till the end because i've used different different um color scheme for uh each uh apartment so yeah so here we are again at the stairway and we come onto a landing area in here and then there is a balcony there that where you can um, just look over, you know, and chill. And there is a hallway that leads onto the other stairway that goes on the third floor. But here we have two different apartments. So the first apartment here is owned by Terrell. Terrell was the tenant that was working out downstairs so um there is a small hallway and if you follow the hallway all the way to the l area the l shape area you know uh at the end of the hallway there is the living area here and uh tyrell is tyrell jefferson is uh, doing his residency at sim city hospital so that's how i decorated his uh, living area it's very blue and white you know um, it's called it screams hospital to me I don't know why so um, let's say he likes that color you know and uh, yeah he has just um, his computer there um, nice sitting area and his dining area as well the best part he's uh, is that he has a nice sliding door that leads onto the balcony where he can uh, enjoy the view of the city perhaps and by the um, living and dining area there is a kitchen area so the kitchen on this apartment is different than the the one downstairs it's a little bit smaller but again it's fully equipped uh, everything is in here um, fridge stove uh, oven uh, dishwasher microwave everything is there it's just that it's a a, um, a little smaller and then right beside the kitchen area is the bathroom and if you notice the sinks are beside uh, backing each other so that you know plumbing makes sense and again it's a four-piece bathroom uh, with tub a double sink shower and toilet and after that the hallway leads on to Tyrell's uh, bedroom and you will see that it's very simple and so I did reach the object cap in this building 
so um, I had to you know limit the amount of things I can use you know so I can give all the tenant different um, decorations you know so yeah that was the second apartment of the building and now we're going to tour the third apartment of the building I hope you're not tired yet because there are still few more to go so this one is has a little bit more chic vibe so this is this apartment is uh, owned by the Hendersons so um, they are newly married and they still enjoy the company of each other very very much um, so they're enjoying a meal together right here on their um, dining area there and uh, so yeah they are working at a business corporation somewhere in the city so they're doing very well as well and uh, yeah so they have very chic decoration in here they wanted to have a fake um, a fireplace so they have that in there and uh, a nice uh, burgundy wallpaper in here with black um, items and by the way the um, wall glitch is still working so um, that's why I kept the TV above that uh, drawer there and of course the bathroom area is here right beside the kitchen area and it is exactly above the other bathroom downstairs and the kitchen as well is right above the kitchen downstairs so as I said I wanted to make the plumbing make sense and uh, off of the kitchen there is a little balcony that can overview the spire downstairs or you know maybe they have a nice view um, of the building of the buildings in the city you know so things like that so what is different from uh, with this this specific apartment that this one is a two-bedroom apartment so there is a little hallway first in here where there is a chest of drawer and um, and then there are two doors that leads onto the two different bedrooms. So the first bedroom here is their master bedroom. Uh, it's pretty simple but I like how the color scheme turned out in here. Uh, I tried to continue the chic you know, decor in here with the black uh, wallpapers and then um, the very nice black and white bed and that very nice uh, wallpaper colorful wallpaper there they have a nice view from the window and they have a balcony um, as well and then um, right beside that bedroom there's another bedroom and since they don't have any kids yet they made the second bedroom onto a home office since um, Mrs. Anderson works from home mostly so um, she has a nice desk there uh, with a nice um, light there and uh, let's say they had lots of trophies in their lives so they kept they displayed the, their trophy as well in there and they have some files uh, tucked away as well so that was the third uh, apartment of the building and uh, here we have we are on the second floor and now we're going on to the third floor and again um, the color schemes on to these apartments are completely different as well so here on the right here we have another a very girly apartment so uh, as you can see it's pretty pink in here so as soon as you enter the apartment there is a narrow hallway there uh, it's pretty black and pink and white really nice and the hallway leads onto the other spaces of um, the apartment so here we have the living area and I think this is my favorite apartment of all and um, the lady that was doing her laundry downstairs uh, owns this apartment so this is Nancy Sable she's nurse at Sim City Hospital and uh, today she doesn't have her shift so um, you know she's chilling at home and doing her laundry and things like that so uh, I just like the color scheme in here it's uh, pink and white and I love how this little dining corner looks like it's very pretty uh, and then uh, through the living area is her bedroom and again I continued 
that pink and black um, color scheme and she has just her bed her side table and a computer beside her bed and a uh, wardrobe and then she also has a balcony from her bedroom that's overlooks the spiria downstairs and you know the neighbors can say hi to each other from the balconies and things like that you know and uh, i really like how this one turned out and then of course there is the um bathroom area which is right above the one downstairs and the kitchen right beside the bathroom and it is above the one downstairs as well so i made sure the plumbing makes sense in the apartment in here but as you can see i decorated uh it a little bit differently you know so that it, you can tell that uh it's a little bit girly and it's a girl's kitchen and she's a nurse so she's eating uh healthy food so i kept that fruit basket in there so that was the uh third fourth apartment in here and now we're going to visit this one and this is owned by uh the fernandez family so the fernandez family are living in this specific apartment and they like chic boho vibes um in here and um yeah so i've gone with the uh item that we got from uh, oasis desert event and i've used that countertops that we got from the urban event if i'm not mistaken and it's, it looks really well in there and there is mr fernandez he is a finance analyst in a big corporation as well so you know he's just checking a few things while his wife uh, is cooking really yummy food in there for uh, him and their daughter so I will just hover over the bathroom and the kitchen area since they are all the same but I just wanted to show you what's in the kitchen for her so she stays at home with her daughter you know um, she takes a good care of her daughter but she stays busy so what she does is she cooks very yummy food she has her own website and the tenants from the apartment uh, order food from her as well so that's what she does you know she is doing her business at home you know so yeah and as the one downstairs this one has also two apartments um two bedrooms sorry so this is the first bedroom this is the master bedroom and again i've used all the items that we got from the oasis event and they're beautiful in here very bright uh looking you know and they have also a balcony area and then on the hallway there i've just uh put a um a bookshelf there with a chair and the the next bedroom is owned by their daughter here so she is into ballet and uh, I've used the ballet wallpaper as a feature wall so it makes the room very nice um, and a tip for um, making a room bright is to have everything white wallpaper and flooring white so the room uh, seems bigger than it is you know so here she is doing her homework she's a very good girl there and uh, yeah so she has a nice view onto the front of the building and she has also her wardrobe uh, tucked away over there so this is the oh my goodness I've lost count fifth yeah the fifth apartment of uh the building and there are two more i hope you're not tired there are two more to go and that's it and uh, this is the last floor of um this building and we're going to uh check the apartments from the landing area so this specific apartments is the jones apartment and I've gone for the items for, from the Café Grande event in here and there they are, uh, husband and wife are there. So they just got a new baby recently so uh, Mrs. Jones uh, is staying home with the baby for a little while. But both of them are lawyer 
So one is a uh, corporate lawyer and one is a family lawyer, but they're both lawyers. And uh, yeah, they're enjoying uh, their coffee while their baby is asleep. So as you can see here, the living area is completely different as well from the other ones. And I'm just giving you, um, you know, decoration uh, ideas in here, you know. So you can decorate your living room like this. And of course, the bathrooms and the kitchen area are completely the same. So I did reach the object capped while I was uh, filling this specific apartment. So you will see it's pretty empty than the other ones. But I still managed to put enough items in here. So in the hallway here, we just have another bookshelf for them. Since they are a lawyer, they probably have lots of law books in there. And then this is their bedroom um, with the same color scheme with the deep green here. I love this green color. And the other bedroom is owned by the little baby there who is taking a nap. And I've used the new crib we just got from the recent uh, pregnancy event. And this is a little baby Jones uh, bedroom. And I think I did put quite enough amount of items in here. I like it. So you can, of course, change it into any um, children's room that you like, you know, any purpose uh, room if you like. And the last uh, apartment of this building is this one. Uh, this is pretty bright as well. So here is Miss uh, Sharon Morales. She is a single mom and she's doing very well. She is also into finance uh, at a very big corporator. But um, no, actually she's software software engineer at a big corporation as well in the city. So she's working uh, mostly from home as well um, while taking care of her kids and she has two sons but this is how i decorated the area she they are very simple so i did use this specific tv there because it has the controller there just to say that there are boys living in this specific apartment there and i've used the family couch that we get from the family event i think that's how the event is called i don't remember i'm so sorry and um here is the kitchen and I tried something different in this kitchen. I used the recent wallpaper that we got as a feature wall and it looks really nice in here in the kitchen. So uh, make sure you look into that. And then uh, through the living area, there is um, a door that leads onto uh, Miss Sharon's bedroom and it's very pretty. You can tell she has some character as well. And she has a balcony that leads, um, that overviews the spa area as well. And then off of the living area again, there is another bedroom. That's, uh, that's um, the boys' bedroom. So her boys are in high school and they are very good boys as well. Very, very neat as you can see. And I am so surprised how much I could fit in this little room in here so i'm pretty happy with this bedroom in here and uh, so yeah that concludes the tour of this apartment building and um i had so much fun filling up all those little apartments with different tenants and different um you know um color scheme and all of that so I hope you guys enjoyed too. I hope you stayed with me till the end in here. Let me know in the comment below if you stayed till here. So here I am sharing with you the grids number if in case you want to recreate this in your town. And as I say, usually if you do recreate it, make sure to tag me on so I can see uh, what you've done with your version. And uh, yeah, so I'm just sharing the grids in here. Um, the yellow rooms are the L-shaped rooms, uh, so that's really easy to recognize. And uh, if you cannot take a screenshot of um, the grids in here, I will post this 
uh, apartment building reads on my Facebook so make sure you check uh, this apartments grid in my Facebook um, so yeah so that concludes the tour of this apartment building quirky apartment building I hope you enjoyed the tour as I did enjoy showing it to you I will see you next time with another house to video pretty soon uh, till then take care stay safe and happy simming